Howdy, howdy, folks. A-Train here with you for another episode of Life is Feudal, Forest Village. Uh, happy New Year's Eve, Eve, Eve. Uh, let's just say happy college football playoff day. Yeah, that's it. That's the ticket. We'll go with that one. Um, let's load into Deerfield here. See what's happening. Charcoal is much more effective than firewood, but it's more difficult to get. Build a kiln, hire a kiln, or produce charcoal from firewood. You can build several kilns to increase charcoal productivity. Of course, uh, in doing so, you have to um, increase your firewood production, which means you have to increase your log production. So you have to balance all that out because you can wind up you know, without firewood. And so typically I like to reserve charcoal for producing um, uh, cast iron in the uh, furnaces. Hey, look, it's Deerfield. We're back. Oh, Miley Cyrus. Oh, Miley Cyrus didn't die. Minor Cyrus died. Oh, man. We'll miss you, Minor Cyrus. Let's play a Minimize this. Get this down here. Yeah. Meanwhile, Sa Sa Sal? Sai? Saik? Um, has grown up and ready to study. So here's Deerfield, in case you forgot. The port city of Deerfield, and we have turned it into quite the port city. Let's show you the the view from from uh, out to sea here a little bit of uh, of the island, and and looking into the natural harbor that is uh, where we decided to build. So we've got lots of fish farms, and we got a port, which we have an expedition that's out in the boot, out and boot at the moment, uh, and we have a couple of uh, of trading uh, docks which uh, we've found are very cool to have. Allows us to get lots of stuff. Wait, what do we have here? Chicken feathers. I get chicken feathers. Right? Oh, I have a chicken coop. No wonder we have chicken feathers. Duh. <laughs> um, I guess at some point if we build a fletching, fletcher's shop or whatever, we can fletch. So, obviously, it's winter. Gee, that's smart, A eh, train. Wow, we're so glad we have you for this information. Yeah, I know. It's important. Uh, let's look at our supply status here. We have uh, quite a bit of logs, quite a bit of stone, quite a bit of ore, and a pretty good bit of clay. In fact, we have so much clay, we clayed out the clay pit. The clay pit is now gone. It is now done. So uh, we're going to look to um, reclaim that land. Let's go ahead and set that up. Shall we? I think we shall. Um, let's see. Doink. If we do that, and then just do... And I want to do this real careful so it's right in the area of the clay pit. Just kind of get it a little smoothed out there a little bit, I think. I mean, it's probably going to look wonky, but then again, if it levels out, maybe we can build a house. And someone could put their basement in the clay pit. Or what was the clay pit would be good for... Yeah. Then they could have a basement. And if they have a basement, they have... Uh, they could build a model railroad. Yeah, that'd be cool. Wait, what? <laughs> um, oh, they could build a tornado shelter for the village. For when these a-hole tornadoes come through. Uh, what else we got? We got a bunch of, of hey, we got a whole lot of that. We got quite a bit of firewood. And lots of fish. The fish numbers have come down, though. But <laughs> that said, the meat number has gone up. <laughs> so we have lots of food and lots of food options in our village. You can choose fish or meat. We have lots of uh, vegetables, and we even have some fruit and nuts, which means we have some nutty people. Um, and we have some bread and pie. We have pie available, too. So, yeah. Uh, and pottery. We have lots of pottery, which we've learned that you can trade for good stuff like these uh, silk warm coats and uh, warm clothing. So instead of having to make it, we just send stuff to the trade dock, namely pottery, which works great because it just, uh, I think the potter's house is right here. It takes in clay and water, makes pottery, and pottery trades very well on the market. And then we just, so we use the donkey to move uh, pottery, which I think is mostly in this barn. Yeah, in this barn, over to the dock, and we set up a trade, and then they approve the trade, and boom, confetti, we're set. So, cool stuff. I think we're trying to get some blankets, comfy blankets. I, I, I would like comfy blankets. Would you like comfy blankets? I think I'd like some comfy blankets. There's some pottery here. Let's see what that trade's for, comfy blankets. Should be right there. Okay, so now we put in what we want to trade for what, right? And then we're going to start counting up. How many, and see how many of these it takes to get one of these. All right. 
All right, take six. So um, that's not bad. So we can ship. Well, wait a minute. Before we do that, I want to check this one to see if we're. No, we don't have a trade set up there. All right. So we're going to send. Donkey's currently moving ore. We need another donkey. How do we get another donkey? I don't. I don't know. I don't. I don't understand this. I, maybe we have to build a second caravan stable, and then we have to build the the mating ritual place. Uh, that's right here, the the donkey farm, because donkeys don't just magically appear out of nowhere. The stork delivers them, or you know, birds and the bees and whatever happens. So, not quite sure, but we're gonna have to get another donkey in here before too long, because this donkey's gonna get old and tired and die. Oh wait, here is a donkey farm. We've got a don donkey farm. What am I talking about? We've got a donkey farm. So, I don't know if we need to build, like, two or three donkey stables and then send the donkeys over here, and then they'll make more, they'll make baby donkeys. So, maybe we'll explore that. We're not going to do it while the, you know, the ground's covered with six inches of snow. Uh, okay. So, we'll keep moving the ore. I think the ore's coming from over here. There's a bunch of ore there. Oh, you know what? No, there's more ore out here. We have a new uh, area we built out here. Yeah, this place is almost full. We're going to move this ore down to the village here where, you know, the, the blacksmith shop is. And that's where we make our tools and stuff. So that will work out. All right. Cool. Um, yeah, so we've got lots of clothing. I mean, we should have some happy campers. we got tools. <gasps> Oats. Ooh. <laughs> ruh <-roh. laughs> Now we see we have. Where, where are we? We're in spring. Oh, that means we're just about to uh, crack a new um, deal. Let's, because uh, we just opened like this field, and that field's producing a lot of food. This is our typical. Um, now, you know what? We're going to go uh, potatoes on this field for now. We're going to go a bigger field for oats. I just want to make sure that we get plenty of oats in. Oats are fast growing, so we should get a nice crop there uh, and soon to uh, keep our chickens from dying. Because that would suck. All right, let's roll. Roll, tide, roll. And there's the thaw, hooray, and huzzah. Uh, what temp oh, temperature we're up. We just shot right up to 35 degrees, so that's good. We got lots of people who need jobs, so uh, we're going to put them out there, put them out there. Uh, we can put you folks out there. Sure. We'll book them out. We got four bakeries going. We could probably have another. Because it just doesn't seem like you can produce enough bread. It really doesn't. Uh, and we can keep the miners in full time. <laughs> doing the minoring thing. <laughs> uh, cast iron. We have 110 of. <laughs> and we have 339, you know, good tools. High quality tools. So our people are well equipped. Uh, what do we have? That's salt, right? Yeah. And that's salted food. Um, we've got the, the windmill working. We, we need more job sites, I guess. That's ultimately what it comes down to. And we can start trading away more stuff. Um, I mean, I guess we could put five people in here. Yeah. I mean, I, I just I don't know what we do here. To get a donkey, maybe we have to fully staff it. Maybe they rub their hands together and make them from clay or something. I, I don't know. <laughs> Just making stuff up at this point. All right, cool. Oh, here's the um, spot they filled it in. Hooray! Um, hmm, I'm not happy with how they filled it in though. Uh, that's okay. I think I can. I want. I want to make that. Well, I guess. Mm, I guess this isn't the worst deal. Let's let's make roads through here. Reconnect the roads, and we'll see how we feel about it then. Yeah. Because uh, then that gives us room to build the road up this way, like that. Okay, cool. These guys are just staying around, picking their noses, looking for something to do. Uh, this kind of builds this way, but we'll just hold it right there. Hopefully we could plop a house in there at some point. Let's see. Yeah. Swell. That'll work nicely. Okay. 
So we'll keep that in mind. Now, the question is, can we put one here? And the answer is yes. Haha, -ha. sweet. All right, love it when a plan comes together. All right, gatherer types, go gatherer. Oh yeah, he's hunting that wolf. You're done, dude. <laughs> Goodbye. Um, gatherer types. Let's see here. We have a lot of logs up here too. We're gonna need to ship those down because uh, we don't have so many up here. Uh, let's change the priority on that. Let's uh, let's dump this and let's uh, let's set up moving logs from here to here. That's our primary firewood production for the for the village and uh, hell I don't even see any firewood right now in the well wait a minute that's just not in that barn there you go there's 611 there we got four barns that serve the center of town here this is one there's two there's three and there's four so that's kind of how that works now uh, having people that need to uh, need to work. I think at this point we can add more fishing. Let's do that. Uh, yeah, let's put that right there, and we'll get somebody out to build that. Great. Now we've got. Now we're balanced out well on our uh, manpower, as it were. And we'll be able to put a, another series of fishing docks in here to provide more fish. So we have lots and lots of fish. Yeah, let's get that built. And then I'm going to need to set up... I think i got to do one more past that. And then the T section goes in after that. Yeah, that looks right. I think that's right. Because then there will be one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good. So that's complete. Hey, sweet. The expedition's back. And they found what? 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 Wait, what did we find? <laughs> Res, wa Res Walnut? What the hell is that? Does that mean we can grow, grow walnut trees? I guess so. <laughs> because that's what I always wanted. Hmm. Now, that would be an example of where you really want to save right before the expedition comes back. I'd forgotten when the expedition was coming back. So, uh, let's, let's send them. It's one thing we have in mods. You can get um, goofy stuff like that. All right, we're going to do, yeah, this. Uh, so, we'll... We'll put like two people on there to load up the ship and then we need to shift production over to the usual. Uh, it's going to be vegetable pies here and we'll do f meat pies here and then we'll do fish pies here. Okay, swell. Okay, we'll get, uh, nee, 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 nee. get uh, this built. Do, 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 do. And then once that's built, uh, we're going to go ahead and lay out another fish farm. I know I talked about doing a seafood farm. Should we do a seafood farm here? Maybe we should try that. What the hell is this? Oh, brine house. Hmm. I haven't done a brine house. The butcher shop, that might be able to might come along. Oh, once we get some pigs and stuff, then, you know. All right, so let's uh, let's look at doing a seafood farm, shall we? I think we shall. All right, let's line it up right there. Doink. Oh, great. This one's going to hit us, too. Swell. All right. Um, all right, so that, we're going to pause that. And then we're going to build. Uh, you know what? I think this is coming to the end. Yeah, this is getting a little far out to our port area here. That's where that's going to go. And here comes the tornado about to sweep. Did it sweep? Did it miss us? Oh, it's the other way. Oh, it's out over the ocean. Oh, it did miss us. It went through the outer area of the port. That was weird. 
Okay, whatever. It hit something somewhere, I'm sure. Tore up something that we probably needed. Jerks. Okay. Walnuts. Well, hmm. Okay, how are we doing on oats? I see oats are coming in. They're harvesting the first load already, so that's good. So we're going to be in good shape on the oats front. Uh, okay, that's built, so now we can get busy on this. The building is almost full. Yes, I understand. Is that this building? Wait, it's not that building. Which building is it? Which building is almost full? Well, it was almost full, and now it's not so almost full. All right, so let's see. Where are we collecting stuff now? We can't. We sent. Ah, uh, yeah. Here's our kind of collection point. We cleared that out of resources. So uh, we're up over the crest of the hill at this point, and that's kind of where I think we're going to lay down some more pathing. Um, hang on, let me pause here. Building is almost full. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Uh, where's the path? Where's the path? Where's the path? Path, path. There it is. All right. So we built it up to the crest. Let's just uh, take it from there and just kind of run it. Kind of goes a bunch of... Wait, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Mouth slipped out of my hand there. Um, what if we go this direction? Wait, go to the peak. Yes, thank you. That would be good. And then let's look at... No, we don't want that. That's kind of goofy. Oh, okay, that's not so goofy. Build the road that way, and then maybe we can go this way. Maybe this way? Okay. Go straight. If I can go straight, we'll go straight. There. We'll do that. Hit it. We'll get some people out of the mines. And uh, let's see. So at some point, we're going to need to establish a new clay pit. And I think we had examined <laughs> that this spot right here <laughs> looks perfect for a clay pit right across from the pottery barn. Um, yeah, you, like, I don't want to... I don't want it to interfere. Oh, wait. There we go. Hang on. Now, there's more if we get over here, but I don't want to go on to the path thing, the paths. All right, let's just build it there and see what happens. Oh, sweet. I think that's going to work. We'll see. It's going to be real close. Um, oh, we can put some people on that. And for the port, now they should have the basics loaded up. Oh, wow. They're almost ready. Sweet. That's gone quickly. Now there's zero... It's saying there's zero people. I had two people assigned working this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, the seafood place is uh, ready to go. I guess it needs two people. That's interesting. Where are they getting? Oysters? Seafood. Okay, whatever. So those employ two people. All right. And we're going to have extras, so why not build another one? Let's just see how this goes, because we haven't played with this this uh, mod. There, build that. Pretty slick looking little farm area, huh? I like it. And then we may add a couple more uh, fish farms out here at the end. It's just we're getting a long ways away. Here's this stupid... Uh, Rudolph running around here. How are we looking here? We got some vegetable pies. I think those were in um, production. Buckock. Lots of oats. Hey, Trolley Man, what's happening? Managed to tear you away from Tower 3D Pro here for a minute. One of two. Okay, so one... Hmm, that's weird. I 
right, so, okay, the fish pies are done. That's this guy, so you can go back to bread making. Thank you. And pretty soon the meat pies are going to be done. Actually, the meat pies are done. They're waiting for transport. Somebody just needs to get off their butt and take them over. They, uh, drop us down out of warp speed here. And while I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead and kick a save in because uh, you know, we had an issue previously where we did a um, first person view and it went kerplunk kerplooey on us. Carrying to storage, what are you carrying? Oh, he's, he's a baker, so he's carrying, he's carrying stuff. All right, so there's nine meat pies. We need to... Oh, he's carrying stuff from there elsewhere. Well, wait, wait, wait. What do you... He's... Why is he carrying flour to storage? That's weird. <clears throat> oh, okay. Cool. Oh, um, Gilu. Gilu's one of our favorite people. Hey, Kaylee. No, May. Aunt May, mm -hmm. what are you carrying? You're carrying flour. Okay, well, we're gonna we're gonna let you carry the flour, get it in here, and then we're going to use you. Okay, cool. Open inventory. Take two pies. Okay. Turn around. Let's run you over here, really down the steps. Run over here and build. Toot your horn. And the game crashed. Damn it. Crap. That's why we saved. That's why we saved. Doggone it. Sorry, people. This is going to take a minute here. Because it's got to re download, which is stupid. I don't know why it does that. Um. Hey, I can figure out how to send the save in. And, um... Uh, come on. Yep. Alright. So you're going to have a blank screen here for just a minute. It's going to be kind of gray. Yeah, I, I know. Your stupid thing crashed. And it's not because of the... I, I don't think it's because of the... Okay, I get it. Choose that window. Uh, task manager. Let me figure this out here real quick. Give me a minute. Um, I don't think it's because of the mods, because we were having this kind of issue previously. What are we doing here? Why are we taking so bloody long to get anything up? Task manager, open. Okay, that, there we go. That bumped us out. Okay, there's the task manager. We got that closed. Okay, very good. So now, stand by. Just a minute here. I got to give the, the game a minute to re-download. Uh, you've done LAX and KPHL. Cool. Nice. Um, yeah, K, uh, KPHL. Uh, Philadelphia really is fun. Uh, if you have not yet... Um, keep in mind, okay, it's re-downloaded, good. All right, let's relaunch it here. Um, keep in mind that you, uh, if you're running uh, the two sevens, you can land aircraft, small aircraft, uh, on two six, um, runway two six. And that goes, let's see, up to some 737s can land on there, A320s can land on there. And, like, MD-80s, I think, can land on 2.6. I mean, you generally just want to put, like, your GA traffic on it. Um, and then, boom, they just pull right off and they're in the GA ramp. But anything, uh, the small um, the small stuff, uh, like your little uh, Air Wisconsin stuff, and, um, let's see, Piedmont... 
those little jets typically can land on two six so that frees up your um you know if you're landing them on on two seven right it frees them up or if you're landing on two seven left whichever uh and if you need to know you know how to switch them over just you know tell them to enter final runway two six and then you give them clearance to land clear to land to runway two six you know and that's how you switch a runway. But you gotta do it pretty early on because if they get into the long dash line, basically they're on the ILS at that point, and then they'll wind up having to go around. So it can get wonky. All right, uh, so I guess we're just gonna let them hash this out with um, moving stuff around. Somebody will do it. And eventually our expedition will get underway. Early fall means we won't get it until next summer. Um, so we'll go from there. All right. Uh, there's two less people there. Oh, this is almost built. Sweet. Let's go ahead and speed this back up. Get the seafood farm. Gosh, the moose is just trotting around. Or that, I guess it's a moose. Reindeer, whatever it is, it's a moose. All right. We're going to add two more people here take three people out of here uh, which actually we're going to turn right around and we're going to add a couple more in because why not if it's good for the moose huh ah, it's good for the gander oh that's goose sorry uh, okay uh, what are we looking at here everything looks good numbers wise how's that clay pit hey clay oh clay pits kind of close to the sh Ugh. Hmm. Hmm, not sure if this is going to work, but we'll see. We'll put six people to work in. Actually, we don't need six people to work in there. Oh, the donkey's chilling. Oh, nope, there he goes. He's off. Yeah, when the now when a storm hits and the tide comes up, this could be a problem. <laughs> of course, I'm kind of hoping a storm hits and the tide comes up and rolls over Oklahoma this, this evening. So, But, uh, yeah, folks, go in there and just, just dig away. It may fill up a little bit of water, but you know, get your feet wet. Uh, we'll see if we can get you some comfy boots or something, you know, for your troubles. Uh, oh, that's pretty full, which means um, we can cancel that. All right, Donkey, we are going to have you move pottery. Oops, wait a minute. I don't think I picked the right thing there. Pottery. From... Uh, here to here. I think that's where it is. Nope. Yeah. Jeez. We've got a crap ton of pottery. <laughs> okay, so we built all these roads up here for a reason. It was to help access more resources, uh, including... I see a new resource-rich area over here. Of course, this helps us... I mean, we haven't had to dig, like... Uh, I think we dug an ore mine. We haven't had to dig a stone mine. So that's worked out nicely. Let's just get that road built out over there. Oh, hey, yo, hold it. Hold it. Harvest, people. Harvest. Okay, all the farm fields are looking good. And this That's effectively empty. Uh, you got nothing left. You know, we're going to lose apples there because the idiot didn't start soon enough. You guys, uh, Mr. Potato Heads, go ahead and start pulling that stuff in. Building is almost full. Yeah, I get that. But that's okay. Those resources are getting used. Potato. Pull those in. Very good. How are we looking here? Okay, we got... Uh, oh, we're, we're about ready to roll here. Sweet. All right, this can go back to bread. No, not fish pie. Bread. Thank you. And really, there's probably pie there. Yep, there's one vegetable pie. That's all we need. Someone just needs to take it over. And then the ship is off. Well, then they got to go through the build cycle. All right, so that, we'll fix that. Get those gathered. Uh, okay, we're going to we're gonna venture to be dangerous here. We're going to save the game. And see if we can drop down our warp and find a kid. Somebody's standing around doing a whole lot of nothing. 
Not a lot of kids in town. There's a child. Well, they won't work. No, we can't pull them up. Um, herdsman. We can borrow a herdsman here for a minute. Hey, Gene. Mm -hmm. Come here. Oh, you're carrying food to the house. Okay. Carry food faster. I have you go shake the trees. Come on. Come on. Okay. All right, Gene. Come here. Run over here. Nope, nope, not there. Go around the other side. There we go. This is where I need you. Okay. Start you right here, and nothing there. Okay. Go this tree, nothing there. Go this tree, nothing there. This tree, that tree's clear. That tree's clear. Okay, good. Well, okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. Interact. Oh, she's she's clearing that tree. Interact. Making your job easier there, gardener lady. Interact. Very good. Interact. Back up. Interact. And interact. We will have apple pies for Thanksgiving. Interact. Very good. Okay. That should have cleared the trees. And 347. Sweet. All right. Good show. So once the, again, if you've missed it previously. Cool. Well, um, let's see what time it is. And maybe we can get together and do like a test session. If you set your system up so that it's working, uh, I'll set mine up. Because I, I just don't know how it all, I, I don't know how multiplayer interacts. It's like we have to create a connection between the two machines, which I get, uh, and all that. And I don't know if there's like, if everything is internal in the game or there's a Skype component or what exactly is involved. So, uh, but yeah, we'll do like a, a test set or something. Holy crap, is that a bird flying low or is that the shadow of a bird? That's a bird. Okay. Anyway, uh, so when harvest time comes around, remember you can go to first person view and the key is with the orchards is all you gotta do is do what I just did. It only takes a minute to take all the fruit off the trees because once it's on the ground, it can get picked up. If it's on the trees, when you hit, when you drop below freezing, you lose it. It's dead, Jim, it's over. Uh, like these potatoes, I could go and harvest manually, but it would take a long time and we've got 10,000 potatoes. <laughs> we, we, in fact, we're probably almost to capacity on food. All right, take it easy, have a good day. Um, I was hoping we get more of the oats out of ground, but I think, well, wait a minute, doofus, what'd you just do? There we go. Accidentally turned that off. All right, we got 790 oats, so we got a lot of oats going on here. Swell. And the ship is waiting on one stupid pie. Are we serious right here? There's a pie right there. What are you doing? You're carrying a resource. Where are you going with it? Oh, someone just walked out of here. Hey, hold it, hold it, hold it. Pause. Turn this off. Who is this? Mm -hmm. Carrying food to the house. Gilu. Oh, our favorite. Gilu was like citizen of the year when he was a kid because he did this stuff so well. All right, but we're going to actually check on where Chicky Poo go. There she is. Uh -huh. Because she's about to be empty handed. She's carrying water into the bakery. Um, so, we're going to. Hang on. Save. Yeah, I know. Department of Redundancy Department. But that's just so if it crashes again, we're on top of it. All right. Carry. Okay. Now, we're going to take you. Go down the steps, across the street, into here, open the inventory, pick up one stupid pie. Okay. Turn around. Run it over to the boat. Run, run, run. I'm going to do this before the game crashes. Build. Boom. Get out of first person view. 
Sweet. We got everything we need. All right. Build it, people. Load the ship. Take you back over to bread. Doink. All right. So now we need six people. We really don't need six. Two will suffice. Because all they're going to do is build the ship up for departure. And that's going to get it ready. It'll be ready. It'll come back, like, late summer. Okay. Oh, we don't have anybody man the seafood farm. Boop, boop. Now we do. 42 uh, things of seafood. Got a red lobster up in this joint. So this person still hasn't harvested. What an idiot. And see, again, so if you've missed previous episodes, how this works is the, the farmers themselves, we're going to lose all the crops you see we're going to lose 50 wheat here. We're going to lose a couple hundred, almost 300 potatoes there. We're going to lose 43 there. We're going to lose 200 oats there. We're going to lose 100. We're going to lose 1,000 units of food because these blockheads didn't start harvesting early enough. Here we're not going to lose any because we had them take it off the off the, uh, the trees in first-person view, which is quicker. All right. But what happens is the people working the fields harvest to their carrying capacity which is like 13, okay? So they'll dig up 13 potatoes and then they'll throw them over their shoulder and they'll carry them off to the barn. Then they'll go have a sandwich and they'll go to the bathroom and then they'll go sleep or whatever. So if you're in first person view, you can avoid all that. You just dig, 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 get the stuff out of the ground and then it can be picked up and carried to the barn later and you don't have to worry about losing it. The second we drop below freezing here, in just a second, it's early winter, we're getting a brief thaw, then it's going to drop below, and we're going to lose all this crap. Jesus, my phone just freaking, like, went crazy on me. Uh, and all the stuff's going to die and disappear, and we're going to lose it. Not that we need it, not that that's, but it's not good to lose all that. And in your early game, when you first start using fields, because your gatherers, you have to push them further out of the, you know, town or whatever. Um, I know what I need. I need to go to this. Oh, I've got 30,000. Okay, that's good. We might even up that to 40,000, but for now I think we're okay on our limits on everything. Do, 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 do. Yeah, looks good. Um, but yeah, it's more efficient. You, you want to just make sure that the food that you know you grow, you actually can utilize. You get to where we're at and you have 11,000 vegetables, right? You plow all this together, and that's not you, that's not even accurate at this point. It's 11K, right? So it could be almost 12K. It could be just about 11K. So we'll say all this together is like 12,000, 13,000 food, right? And we've got 7,000-something meat and fish. So we've got just way, way tons of food, which is great. You want to have more than you need uh, rather than less so people don't starve. Like, I don't know, we accidentally did early on in this game. So um, this is a good thing. All right, this should, oh, this is going to be picking up clay from in here. But it's not going to pick it up real fast. There's only three people working that, or four people working. So that's okay. All right, let's get on to... These people need to get over here and start working. Okay. Dig up the last of your stuff because it's all going to die. Now it's all dead. All right, now we can pull everyone out of the fields. Well, let them pull the last of their stuff. See, this will show you what's been dug up. Like here, now they've cleared out all the fruit. So it's all good. Sai has grown up. All right, cool. Now we can take all of you out of here and out of here and we can put you and put a couple of you there put some of you there how are we doing on firewood 2249 we got tons of firewood oh, okay let's put a couple people kilning and doing that <clears throat> now this blacksmithing is a little bit um, what's the word I'm looking for deceptive 
Okay, we actually only have one blacksmith's uh, shop. That's right here, right? And that's only got one person working it. Well, where's the 3A train? Uh, that's these two guys working the pottery. Oh, I would say guys. Blake and Camillo. Yeah, it's two guys. What I said. All right. Now, let's see what we got over here. 598. We got tons of pottery going. All right, so we can have the donkey stand down for now. So we're going to trade some stuff, and I think we're going to try to get some blankets. All right. Uh, what did we say? It was six to one. Actually, you know what, donkey? No. Take that last load over there. Because I think we're going to need to get to 600. Wait a minute, what? Oops, I goofed that up. Got to put the where it's coming from first. Okay, it's coming from here. That's going to here. Okay. Oh! Oi! That's it. I didn't know that. Apparently, you can't do seafood farming in the winter. Well, fine. Pick up the stuff that's there and take it in. All right, the expedition's on its way. Hooray. Good. Uh, what can we make? get these people doing? Uh, let's get them building some more fish farms. Well, shall we? I think we shall. Do, 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 do. That's this right chaw. Boop, boop, boop. Just give that moose a little more room to walk. Yeah. We're just going to put three people on the job. Actually, we can put... We'll put six. I only four people running around doing stuff. And we're going to keep the seafood farms manned for now. Um... I want to make sure that's cleared out. Obviously, there's none in the in the barn. But there's plenty there. It seems to be coming in. All right, so the expedition departed in what early winter, so it'll be back early fall, which means the following year we should have a new crop we can grow hope it's something good. I know people are getting bored of potatoes. But hey, you can have nuts with your potatoes. And everyone can have uh, apple pie for Christmas. Hooray. I, it's too bad you can't make apple pie. Everybody's got nice warm clothes. Oh, blankets. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Okay. Let's check the uh, donkey. Okay, donkey's done. Good. All right, donkey. Thank you. You did a good job. Oh, Aaron died in an accident. That sucks. How do these people not have... Oh, hey. Oh, wait. Oh, no. We got this barn right here. That's got... How do you not have firewood? It's right there. It's right across the street, stupid. Go get it. Oh, that's the gatherer's hut. Oops. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Uh, yeah, we don't need them in the gatherer's hut right now. <laughs> Dummy. <laughs> Way to pay attention, our A-Train. All right, so uh, now we can put someone on this. Doink. And someone on this. Doink. Go fish. Do, do. All right. And we got some trees there, but not a bunch of trees. And we got chickens. And the chickens seem pretty happy. I don't think we're going to need... We're, we're going to need flax. Eh, flax is coming along... Um, hmm. She's making warm clothing. I think I'm going to have her shift over to uh, regular clothing here for a bit. And I think we're going to switch this field back over to... Um, let's switch to flax production. and we're, You know what? This one, uh, this one seems to be okay with oats for now. So, where'd the oats go? The oats went there. Donkey! I'm going to try to make this a little easier on Mr. Dude over here. Uh, take the oats from here and move them here. Well, that's not going to do me any good. All right, doofus. Get the right barn. That barn to this barn. There we go. 
See, we want them closer. I mean, this barn would is probably the same distance. This one, but this one's almost full. No? Okay, that's not. I lied. Uh, okay, trade. Let's trade some pottery for some comfy blankets. Well, let's just see what 712 pottery will get us. 712. Get us 128 blankets. Boom. Sweet. So now we got 128 comfy blankets. Yay. Uh, donkey can move those around here uh, in just a bit. Oh, oh, oh. Florida is kicking Michigan's butt. Go SEC. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so it's looking like we should be about kickoff time of the Cotton Bowl, y'all. You know? Let me, um, there we go. And, oh, no, the Cotton Bowl Classic's on ESPN? Really? It's not on ABC? Why wouldn't you have it on ABC? Oh, the Belk Bowl is on. Why wouldn't you have it on ABC? That's stupid. I guess. Whatever. Oh, Schlub Bowl game is on here. Oh, South Carolina's looking bad. Ugh. <laughs> Way to go, Gamecocks. That's what happens when you put, you know... Well, 7-5. and five. Yeah, you really deserve it. Mm. Alright. Um... Let's see here. What am I looking for? Oh, wait. I want this button right there. Let's go back to the Peach Bowl. Okay, cool. We got a bit for the before that game starts. Okay, where are we here? Do, 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 do. Oh, it's spring. Hello. Spring. Spring. All right. Let's uh, get... Oh, we can put one more portion on the fish farms, and we can take those three people out of there, and we can take these people out of here, and we can start putting people here, and yeah. And then we can put out some gatherer types. And how much do we need clay miner wise? I think we'll just mine clay in the winter, but they're moving this along rather rather quickly. Clear them out. And uh, we'll put some people out doing the gather gatherer thing. And then we can send some folks up this way. Wait a minute. How's this barn looking up here? Oh, it's half full. That's good. So we're going to do some gathering up in this quadrant of the map. Yeah, like that. And they can load all that schmutz into this barn, and then we can do this. H have we gotten another frickin' donkey yet? What's the deal? We have no donkeys. How do we get a donkey? Ah, oh, nuts. Maybe we got to build a couple more donkey thingies and transfer them in there for them to get busy. So let's just see what we can do here. Uh, there. Caravan stables. I can't build in this area. Oh, that sucks. Come on, man. This little rippled ridge lines there. We can build over here. A couple spots. Okay, that's not too bad. We'll, uh, need the weather to clear up, though, so I can see what the hell I'm doing. Building's on fire. Oh, two buildings are on fire. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, the Weaver's Workshop's on fire. Another building's on fire. Now that's out. Oh, that's... Stuff everywhere is getting... Oh, the dock's on fire. That's not good. The port. Gee, many Christmas. Oh, the barn's on fire. Fix the barn. And the sawmill's on fire. Damn, lightning's just hitting everything over here. <clears throat> That's not good. Alright, we... Uh, kind of surprised we... Alright, Z's. Somebody's got Z's by them. That means... Baker died of old age. Alright, why do you have... That means I've got... Ah, you.
Well, where the hell were you all this time? Uh-oh. Oh, the sawmill's destroyed. Damn it. Well, that sucks. That explains why he has no job. Building has been destroyed. Well, poo on it. All right. Well, now you got a new job. Tear down what's left of it. And we'll put one person on that. I'll give them something to do. Tear down what's left of it. Okay, I see somebody. Nope. Nope, that's good. Okay, we've got plenty of firewood over here. Got lots of food. Got lots of logs. Uh, okay. Do, 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 do. Okay, uh, is the donkey doing anything? No, the donkey has completed its mission. Alright, donkey! We're going to move... Uh, this barn is, like, really empty. Why aren't people going to get the comfy blankets? Maybe that's something somebody forgot to write into the mod. Hmm. All right. We're going to pick up comfy blankets from here and take them to here. Get with it. All right. Now, uh, oh, I can see for the moment, even though it's kind of dusk. All right. We're going to build two more caravan stables. Put one here, and then we're going to rotate and put another one here. Boom. Okay, now we can put these people to work. Take a couple of gatherers out. There we go. Rebalance the workload a little bit. And there. Okay. Cool. So we'll get those caravan stables built. Once this is torn down, you know, that's going to take some more labor. You know what? Let's get the labor done here. We've got people out here clearing out stuff way up over the mountaintop. You know why? Because there ain't no mountain high enough. <laughs> anyway. All right. Uh, they're getting these outlined. That's good. Let's keep watch on progress here because once that's done, we've got to build a new sawmill because this is our secondary production facility in case things go to hell with this number for the village. The section up on the hill has a little wood chopping block to make firewood, whereas down here, this is our second uh, dealio. Yo. Uh, Lumberjack's Lodge. Uh, Cause I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. Sleep all night, work all day. God, here we go again. Alright. Okay. Part of the issue may have been... Well, there... It's there. There's a well. Ah, we need more wells. Put another well right over here next to this. Uh, it's a community building. It's right there. And we'll just put that. Yeah, I can take up 4x4. Four four. That won't. I'm not too fussed about that. Typically, a well only, I mean, a well only takes 3x3. Three three. Good lord. Can we get a freaking uh, lightning antenna in here or something? Jeez, people. Lightning rod, tower, whatever. Man. All right, how are we doing over here, people? That's going to take quite a bit of our resources, but then we've got a lot more coming in. Um, yeah, things look okay. Things look okay. Build that there. Uh, there's a well right there because they need a well. They're going to need access to oats. And we got oats coming in, right? 
actually we're growing uh we are growing uh flax this year our little field oh look we've got room for a utility field over here let's build that we have room for a utility field right like so except for that stupid stuff there um hmm. okay i do some terraforming which you know how much i love terraforming not flatten the ground i just ooh, i want to be real this is really this little spot right here Okay, this looks like it's about done. That's good. And we're going to send these two donkeys we're going to send over here and then see if they make some magic. <laughs> I know, stupid. Three, two, three. Zayden has grown up and Lena has grown up. Very good. Hooray. All right. Uh, the well is still waiting on someone, but that's fine. It can wait. All right, here we go. Sweet. All right, so we're going to put uh, one person here. Actually, no, we're not... Well, we're going to let them stock this with the stuff they need. But i um, actually going to transfer this animal to here. There it is, there's one. And we're going to transfer this animal to here. Okay. Now, ah, looks like everything got built. Good. Uh, we're just going to put one person here. Working firewood on this end of town. Good show. Okay. Uh, we got nine people gathering. Ooh, wait, wait, hold it. All right, let's check something here. It's late summer. These trees are not in production this year. These trees are already producing. That's good. And these trees are doing quite well. In fact, um, I'm not going to mince words over. Uh, you're there. You are there. 500, 504. Okay, fine. 502, 504. There you go. Start collecting them. Harvest the trees. I want you guys to get an early start this year. 44 out of 336. Dude, you need to freaking go back to Green Thumb School or something. Let's go ahead and start pulling you in. Start pulling you in. Start pulling you in. I mean, they are, but I just want to make sure, hey. Let me reinforce this concept to you people. Get busy. <laughs> Fish farmer Lila died. Oh, Well, Lena can take Lila's place. And then we'll pop a new baby here pretty soon. Where are we up? 85, 88? We have no incoming uh, villagers. I think maybe we need to build a new house. I agree. That's a fine point. Um... And kind of go. No, these are going to be a little bit offset right in here. Boom. That'll work. Put it there. Put her there, pal. We may actually have room to. Oh, did I put it too far back on the path? Nope, nope. It's lined up. Good. Pretty. Um, let's see here. Boop, boop. Yep, we can put an extra couple of. Lots of dirt road there. All right, we were working over here, and I think we may have accomplished what we... Maybe, maybe not. Mm. I see a ripple in the field now. That should not be a factor. It will wind up being a factor. Trust me. 
Oh wait, maybe it won't. Hooray. Build that field. This is just, uh, this is going to become our oats field. Hey, we found, what the fudge did we find? Totally forgot about the expedition. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, Riss Farby. What is Riss Farby? What the hell is that? Corn. Dwarf. Elder. Oh, elderberries. Your mother was a hamster and your father smelled of elderberries. All right, so we've got corn, which we found out sucks. And elderberries. All right, so we're going to switch a field over to elderberries here at some point. Cool. All right. Well, why not go ahead and load her up and send another one? Put one person on that job, and we'll go ahead and start switching these guys over to meat pies and fish pies. And no, we can't do honey pies because we don't have an apiary vegetable pie. We do have a few eggs in the village. All right, everybody, start collecting food. Start bringing it in. Let's go. Bring it in, people. Bring it in. Everybody's looking good over there. You're looking good over here. What? 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 Oh, great. All right, let's see if it's going to stay away. It's coming close. Um, it's going to clip us. Which way am I looking? It's right there. Uh, it's going to just miss. It's in the dark. It's hard to see. Ooh, it just missed. Go to hell. Okay, you have been collected out. Hopefully nobody got killed by it. Great. We've had more damn fires this year. Maybe we need new smoke detectors or something. <laughs> oh man, it's and it's the donkey farm. It's the not the donkey farm, but it's okay. What's going on here? Alright, so we got two animals here, right? So what do we do to breed animals? I I really don't know process is. I'm going to have to look this up. I should have looked it up prior to today's festivities, but I did not. So Again? That's someone's hut. Hut, hut, hut. Come on, the well's like right across the street. You guys could just, you know, there you go. Fix it up. Oh, right. The house is probably done, isn't it? Uh, yep, it's done. And people have moved in. And, yep. So we probably have no room to upgrade it, but that's that's okay. That's two people there. Uh, got all that, got all that, all that, that, that. Yeah, that's what I figured would happen. You get everything, and then you just got to make the pies, because that's typical. Okay, how are we looking here, folks? How are we doing? Everybody feeling good? We liking what we're doing here? Build a seafood farm. That way everything's nice and pretty. Just tell the ship captains to, you know, no, this is a no wake zone. So take it easy. Of course, the seafood probably doesn't care. Okay, we probably need to start relocating some supplies here. And logs would be in order. Ooh, we don't have a lot of logs up here. That's kind of odd. I would expect we'd had more. Hmm. How are we doing firewood? Oh, we got lots of firewood, though. All right, so we can relocate some logs. Donkey! Take them from there and hustle them over the. How are we doing over here? 175 logs. I thought I built a forester's hoopa jupe out this way. No, it's up on the mountain, isn't it? Is it up here? Yeah, there's the forester's tower. Oh, there. That's what we need to do is put them in. 
Actually, we can put a second person. Let me try this. We're going to set this up for two, and we're going to set it up for both plant and reap. And we'll see how that works out. Uh, so we're going to lose... There's a 1,000 food right there. We're still sitting on 11,000. Uh, there's 52 there. Come on, get that stuff pulled in, people. Flax is looking really good, though, because flax grows quick. Grow, grows quick. You get two harvest a year out of flax. Okay. All right, so we got some new people coming in the village. This is good. We went a year there without you know, some teeny boppers or whatever. Erasmus is ready to work. Hooray. Welcome, Erasmus. Welcome to the team. Only got two donkeys. Hmm. We're going to get an early freeze this year. Wipe everything out. I think so. Yep, there it goes. Goodbye. Swell. Uh, okay, so for next year, we're going to make this oats. And then we're going to turn this field here. I'm going to try Dwarf Elder. Elder baddies. Oh, you know what? I wonder if people are going to even bother with that crap. Oh, that makes die. Ew. Yeah, no, we're not going to do that. We're going to go back to potatoes. Okay. Well, uh, the dye goes with the... Um, seamstress shop. Which we built once. <laughs> Didn't do us a whole lot of good because that's where you've got to have the silk uh, cocoons. So you got to set up a silk field, which we have not uh, established. We haven't found that yet on Expedition or whatever. So we've got to get that to uh, be able to grow silk and then we can make stuff. But really, there's almost no point because we can trade for it. So we've got we got these blankets. Nobody's picking up these blankets. It's like nobody's picking up these silk warm coats. Hmm. We could probably get silk pillows and people wouldn't care. What is this? Glass works. Oh, that may be something we do in the near future. Set that up here. Uh, but then we got to have sand. So we'd have to put a sand pit somewhere. Which effectively goes where clay is. Which, that would be a pretty good spot right there. It's close to a warehouse. And then it would go here. Warehouse is empty. And then if the glass works right here, it would just have to go right there. That's a pretty good idea. I like it. Okay. Now, this is running a little short. That's looking good. Do we have meat over here in the village? That's Weaver's Workshop. No, we have fish. Okay, so we're going to use the... Um, so we got all the fish right here. We'll move meat over there. Why is there only five? Oh, okay. It must be going in here. Yeah, there it is. Okay, there's the rest of it. Very good. Uh, so we don't want to... Overburn that barn. We're going to use Donkey. Donkey's moving the logs at the moment. Let's stay on that course. Because it comes here so that these guys can make firewood. So that goes here. It, it goes here. Yeah. Oh, there's 1,014 firewood in town. Okay, I think we can not worry about moving the logs at the moment. All right, so then what we want to do is move meat 
Yeah. From here to here. There we go. Alright, donkey. We got two donkeys. I am just totally going to have to look this up because I am confused. I do not know how this works. Uh, where are we at here? Oh, I do not need this open. Well, you know what? Hmm. Okay. So aside from our little technical glitch we had there... Oop, 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 oop. There is seafood there to be collected, people. Go collect it. How are we looking here? We got pies starting to come in. Yep, that's good. That's good. Good news. 18 people not working. Let's put six here. Put six there. Nobody's gathering at the moment because it's winter. All right, how are we looking firewood-wise over here? I said, oh, there it is. <sighs> we only have two donkeys. And in theory, we could move those two donkeys to here. Whatever. I don't know what's going on. Oh, damn it! Yikes! Hold it! One of our donkeys just got killed. Oh, no! Both of them just got killed! Son of a bitch! Where's the... The frickin' hunter shack is right here! How did these animals get into that area? Seriously! You guys suck! You're eating. You're carrying storage. You're you're doing nothing. You're a hunter. Kill the wolf. Oh, you bastards. And there's a bear right there too. But the wolves, I don't know if the bears kill the mules or not. Dirty. Mm. Maya, you mind getting your act together? Wait, hold on. Hold on. She's going to kill it right now. She's not going to kill it. She walked right by it. You dumb... Mm. Okay, Maya. Hold on. Come back here. Maya. Maya! Hey, you ain't carrying squat. You ain't eating for a week, as far as I'm concerned. Kill the animal. Stab it in the butt. Oh my gosh. You're not even freaking... Thank you, idiot. Where's that bear? You're dead too. And the moose too. Toast. Anyone else? Alright, Maya. Way to make me take control and make you do your job. Thanks. Appreciate you. <sighs> no soup for you. All right. Guess what? These places are now useless. Swell. Man, that ticks me off. Damn it. Can't breed them. <laughs> if you can't breed them, join them. I don't know. Why does nobody seem to be working? There you go. It's only 1,800 clay, guys. You should be able to knock that out here in a couple of years worth of work. All 
All right, we're getting there on pies and stuff. Got lots of oats. We got a sufficient amount of flax. Okay, so this field shifted back to flax production because this this field is going to be oats production to feed the one donkey. Although I think the donkey the donkey eats hay. Um. The oats are for the chickens. Whatever. I'll figure it out. Although that means oats are going to wind up over here. Fish farmer Gylex died. Oh, sorry. A child died during birth. That's terrific. Great. All right, we're into late winter. The temperature's coming up. How come you guys have not gathered... I gotta take first person charge of these things too, because I'm gonna wipe them out and put in fish farms. They're stupid. I mean, we had this number building up earlier. It didn't build up much, but it did build up. Okay. 113. People are walking out there. I saw, saw someone. There's someone right there. It looks like a kid. What are you doing? Who are you? And the game just crashed. Nope, wait. Yep, maybe. Nope, okay. Who are you? Who's... Who are you and what are you doing? No, I want you. Zooey! <laughs> Alright, Zooey, hold on. You are a... Whatever. You're a fish farmer. Okay. Zooey, I have a job for you. Save. Mm -hmm. Okay, Zooey. Come over here. Open inventory. Okay. Take the fish. The seafood. Red lobster needs it. Okay, it's crab legs time. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Seafood coming. Doot doot. Alright, take it in the barn. Boom. Done. Rocket science. Now, that's all you gotta do. Very simple. Excuse me, beep beep. Na, 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 na. Now there's somebody carrying out of here. Okay, good. There's people carrying out of here. That's good. It's real good. Open inventory. Carry another 26. Na, 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 na. Maybe it's just got to be above a certain temperature for them to farm it. I don't know. I think that's probably the case. Do, 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 do. Okay, cool. Thank you, Zooey. Toot your horn. Go away. All right. Are they clearing it out now? Hmm. Yeah, there they go. Now they're carrying it out. Okay, so maybe it's just got to be warmer. Uh, I don't trust that the temperature's not going to drop here again. And we're going to build another house. Oh, wait. Nope. Temperature did go up. And it's early spring. Yep. Yep. It's still going up. All right. Very good. So we can take you people out of here. What are we looking at uh, supply-wise? We're okay there. There's that. Uh, I don't think we need all that many people. Um, hang on. Oops. There's that. All right, what are we building exactly? Oh, we're tearing these down. That's right. Because, yeah, we lost our donkeys. Because some idiot, Maya, didn't do her job. Hmm. Oh, you know what? Okay, I've got an app for that. Check this out. This will work right here, too. This will be righteous. Uh, castle stuff. Stone tower? No, we need a watchtower. You, watchtower. You're going to go right here.
Well, wait a minute. I say that, but the animals... Hmm. Maybe we should put it right there. Well, that's building space. I don't want to do that. <laughs> All right, let's just assume maybe the we go there. Maybe we can put another one over here, and that will cover. Because I'm wondering if the animals spawned through the walls or they actually went through the openings. So, either way, I, I kind of want to cover the opening here. All right, drop this down to there. Okay, that's minimized. Doink. All right. Build it, people. This is stat. This is the priorita. Get that built. And build one of those there, and I think we may build another one over here just to protect this place. That is unacceptable. This is. I think the radius opens up too. As you upgrade these, baby's been born. All right, we got babies coming in. Hooray! Uh, okay. So that's going to take a lot of logs and a lot of stone. Um, how's our log supply over here? It looks pretty light. And I don't have people free to go dink around with that at the moment. All right, how many people are working over here? They're clearing stuff out. They need to go into planting mode. It really only needs one person anymore, I think. So that's going to take them out of play. Um, and now I'm going to build another one of those things over this way. I don't think I'm going to build the big one. now I can't see what the hell I'm doing. Wait, wait, no, no now I kind of can. Okay. Rotate it that way. Boom. Get that built. That will help over on this side of things. Manage the forests. Yes. Okay, what do we got going here? Oh, this one's, uh, this one's moving up quite swiftly. Very good. Even though we do not have a full staff on it. Ah, good. That's up. Uh, yeah. Upgrade it. And upgrade that as well. Because then once they're upgraded, they will, uh, any animals that come close to it, they'll shoot them. Automatically. So, hooray. That's what we need. Okay, are we hauling in the seafood? We are. Good. How are we looking over here? Pie-wise. Oh, we just need vegetable pies, as usual. Oh, so we're going to put you on vegetable pie. We're going to put you on bread. Because, you know, we never have enough bread. And we're in spring. And we got some, wait, what? Oats. Yeah, we're going to get lots of oats in this year. They're going to be hauling oats. Ah, that's funny. All right, how are we looking on our tower mods here? Oh, this one's still bringing in pieces. This one is under construction. Very good. this one's going to cover this entry, this one's going to cover most of the main entry, but something would have to get past both of them to get in there. And we're going to continue the upgrading process, because these hunters apparently don't do their job very well. All right, there we go, improved watchtower, hooray. Now what, what does it take? That's going to take a lot of logs. We're going to take a break on that.
So that's how you can protect your town. There's not a whole lot for them to do anymore. Maybe a waste of resources. So that's one less person there. We've got two out here. And then we got what? How many over here? Come on. We got three over here. All right, we're going to increase that over here. Bring this up to three. All right, so now this can go into planting mode. And this guy's gone into planting mode. And this over here needs somebody. They can go into cutting mode. So I have one person. Well, hello. How are you, lovely? Uh, did I download any mods? Yes, look here. Look here. I have the clay pit which is the best mod ever. If there were one mod, this would be the mod to get, the clay pit. Because it only takes 20, um, 20 logs to make, and it's a pit. Now, people still die in it, which is stupid. But, um, yeah, 20 logs is compared to uh, two, 340. Yeah. So, boom, clay pit. Uh, and then, here's what's awesome. Uh, look here. Pottery's Workshop takes the clay and water and makes a whole list of stuff which has different like recipes and things that you can do. Right? Cool. Right? We're just making me medieval handmade mugs, right? So the mugs, so we take them over here. Look at our port. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Trade dock. Hey. It acts the same as the um, the market acts the same way. So, you take stuff to the trade dock, and then you can trade it for other stuff. Just bought the game. Yay! Yes, get the clay pit mod, and get the trade dock. Those are cool. And you'll want to get the, uh, the pottery workshop, because pottery trades well. Now, I'm about to get the, I'm about to build the um, glass uh, maker stuff. Um... Let's see how much we've got to move. All right, we got see we got 464 pottery, right? So we're gonna get donkey. He's still moving meat around, uh, which is good. So I can't figure out how to breed donkeys. I have this donkey farm, right? And we had this one caravan stables. So I built two to, in the donkey farm. I had fully staffed, and nothing was happening. So I went. And built two more caravan stables, right? And I moved the two donkeys over here, right? Well, they weren't apparently liking each other because they weren't getting busy and making baby donkeys, right? And then a wolf comes in. There's a, a hunter right there, and the wolf kills both the donkeys. Maya the hunter is a slacker. She is on the poop list for the village. Justin Corman. Hey, well, now all the regulars are showing up. Hooray. What's happening? So, all right, they're already starting to harvest. This is good. What was I going to do? Uh, we need, need pies, people. Look, you got nine pies there, morons. There's 18. Y'all are killing me, smalls. 18 of the 20 pies we need are right there. Where is everyone? Oh, apparently nobody's assigned here. Wait, what the hell is the deal? I don't have any other building projects going on, do I? One person. See, it, it acts like there's nothing to do. But there's eight... Look, there's all the pies for the... Alright. Damn it. If you have to, if you want to do something right, you got to do it yourself. Okay. Saving first. Um, yeah, so uh, you want to be careful, though, with the mods you download. 
These four have been these have been good. Uh, not all of them are up to the latest specs of the game, and they'll crash your game. Now, I just saved because I'm going to go into first-person mode because it's been crashing sometimes in first-person mode. All right, where's May? Mm -hmm. You know what, May? You don't get to carry food to your house because you're an idiot. Oh, shoot. I didn't um, unpause it first. May. May? May? Come back here, May. Mm -hmm. Come here. Sorry, May. I know you got to carry food to the house, but you got to carry pies first. We got, an in, we got an expedition that's waiting on you. It's waiting on you. Okay? So carry this over here. This will only take a minute, then you can go back to carrying your food. All right, there's one. Turn around. Go over to the other one. Get some more pies. We only need seven. All right. Back to the dock you go. Pie. Toot your horn. Go. Now, go away. Don't go away mad. Just go away. There. See how easy that was? It took like two seconds, people. Frickin' frack. Man. Why they wouldn't take the pies? I don't understand. But that's all the ship needed. Now... We gotta put well there's one person on it, so they're working on building it, so they'll they'll get it done. Okay. And then we'll send off another expedition. Hooray. So uh over here I've got seafood farms, which uh grow stuff for the local red lobster and Joe's Crab Shack. Uh what else have I built here that's a cool mod? Oh, hey, look here. These are good to get too. So there's two other mods you gotta get, Heather. Um, this is one. It's a Forester's House. You can put five people in here as compared to the Forester's Lodge, which only holds two. All right, so that's a good one. And here's another good one. Hunting Lodge, it'll hold five people as compared to three. All right, so that's awesome in an awesome sauce sort of way. So there you go. Those are the mo Oh, oh, wait, but wait, there's more. One more. <laughs> uh, herb Garden. All right. So you can build a herbalist's hut. Police force. I'm pretty sure that's what the locals are for. They, they club each other. Yeah, I guess a constable would be good to have. Um, that I think that would be like a, a, a castle um, building. Anyway, herb garden. Okay, grows herbs year-round. Screw winter. <laughs> uh, the herb garden um, grows herbs and then... Uh, so you don't have to have an herbalist hut to go out and search for them. So the herb garden looks cooler. You know? Look at that. Looks cool. Yeah? Let me go ahead and just push play here so we can get back to daylight. Uh, and then the other thing is a... Uh, oh, a healer. So there's the healer shop, right? Look how big this, you know, the frickin' hospital, right? which will take care of 10 people with one healer, which is stupid, right? Well, forget that noise. You build this guy, the healer, it's smaller. It's the same size as the house. In fact, it's smaller. And they'll take care of up to three people. Oh, wait, I've already got one. Hang on, it's right um, here. The village healer. Ta-da! So. Cool stuff. Oh, but wait, there's more. <laughs> Hang on. Let me find one. Uh, oh, it's up here. There's another cool thing. When you're early in the village, you know how you start using firewood? You build one of these things. A wood chopping uh, block. And this takes like... Uh, let me pull it up. Right here. 15 logs to build the chopping block. And one person works it and they make firewood. So early on, that's a good way to make firewood. So you don't have to build a lumberjack's lodge right away. Expedition has begun. Hooray! Uh, that's pretty full. Oh, now we want to see the herb garden. Pause. Wait, the oh, sun's coming up. Look at the herb garden. It's pretty. I like it. What else do I have here? Uh, I've got uh, mineral salt mine, which I haven't messed with yet. And then the sand pit, which goes over clay and it pulls in sand. Actually, I'm going to set one of those up because um, I want to 
Uh, where was I going to put? It was going to go over here. Yeah, right by the dead people. By the barbecue joint. <laughs> Alright, first off, I need to see what it looks like. Which way it faces. Uh, I can't see... I want to see what... Mm, killing me. Alright, it's going to go right here, though. Uh, let me hit shift. Come on, where is it? Oh, it gave me a way to build... Oh, here we go. Boom. There we go. Alright, so we need two people to build that. So we're going to start mining sand, as opposed to pounding sand. Um, what else do I have here? So sand, there's a silver mine, a clay pits key. Um, oh, let me show you how the trading deal works. Did I do the trading stuff yet? Donkey's still moving food. All right, donkey, move pottery from here to, oh, let's use this one. Thou. We have nothing in the inventory currently. And see what I had gotten back from some of my trading? I don't know why people aren't getting them. But that must be a flub with what people are. But we got silk warm coats. And comfy blankets. So we've got those in the in the town and nobody's going to get them. But I've got tons of warm weather clothing and stuff. Oh my god, I got 3,000 freaking firewood. Wow. Holy shnikey. Put somebody out of the firewood business here. And let them go back to being just a schlub. Um, hey, go get those apples. And you pull that flax. You pull those apples. We want apple pies for Thanksgiving, people. Let's go. Because we ain't got pumpkins yet. And our fish numbers have come up. Look at that. We got 10,000 fish and meat. Ha! Love it. Tons of oats. We got tons of everything. Look at look at the tools. Man, this village is kicking all sorts of ass. All right, she need to shift her back to um, warm weather clothing. Of course, we can always trade for it. Building is almost full. Well, suck it. That's almost full. What can we move into town? Oh, we're going to move the stone into town. Because I don't think we got any stone here. Uh, okay, stuff's regrowing. We need to build a new... Hang on, what time of year is it? Fall? I'm going to build another donkey farm, uh, dealie. Since the last one got... We had to raise it because we lost the donkey. Okay, boom. Build that. so stupid. That's one thing that's kind of dumb about this, is you, you have one donkey and you can't, the donkey farm's not growing new donkeys and so you get one new donkey here fish farmer Christian died. Aww Christian and you can't get new donkeys so that's kind of kind of hinky Okay, but our fish farming is kicking ass. Oh, you know what? Uh, what we can do real quick, too, is build another house. Because we want chittens. Boom. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Belay that. Belay that order. I didn't have it facing the right direction. Blockhead. Am I looking at the front here? Well, there it was in the right direction. Damn it. <laughs> I had it right. There. Okay, cool. Okay. Kendrick has grown up. Oh, nope, nope. Now we done froze. Okay. Uh, everyone out of the fields. And... Um, little bit of dirt road right and thaw. Okay, so that'll get that built quick. 
And I guess the salt mine or the mine over here is still... Oh, wait, no. People are, are available. Swell. Oh, really? We can't mine it because it's the time of year it is? Okay. All right. I, I That's cool. I get it. All right, whatever. To the clay mines. All right, so get people in the clay mines. What else can we do? What else can we allocate? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We have plenty of herbs. We don't really need anything at the moment. So we're going to have people kind of slumming around a little bit here. Uh, what's this guy doing over here? Collecting. Oh, let's add another person. Get them working. Here's the nice thing about the, um, oh, what's all red when I'm trying to build the, oh, okay. Well, holy Jesus. <laughs> People, there's a freaking, oh, these hunters are pissing me off a of fall. Hunting lodge right there. Now, oh, here's the cool thing, Heather. The uh, hunting lodge, look how big the radius of the circle is. It's huge. Look at that. Big ass circle. Okay, keep that in mind. Because I'm going to pull up just the regular hunting lodge. Look how small the circle is. You can see the whole circle on the screen, right? But you can't see the circle here. <laughs> it's that big a radius, all right? So that's a good thing about a hunting lodge. Um, put someone else over there, I guess, because there's a bear right here, right down the street. Stupid people. Now, uh, why is it all red? Okay, the sand... Um, the sand pits are just like clay, right? There, there's minimal clay in where it's red, but where, there, where it's green, there's a lot. That's that's what the, the deal is there. So red, it's not so good, or you can't build in that area. Green is great. So here you could have 5,000 clay, or sand in this case. Yeah, and so that's the same situation with this. Watch this. See, here's the Forester's Lodge radius, right? Forester's House. See the edge of the circle? <laughs> you can't see the edge of the circle. It's barely on the screen. If I close, if I turn these off, you'll see it. Okay, so there's that guy. Look at the radius. So yeah, that's what you want to build. Screw this Forester's Lodge. <laughs> I mean, the only reason I have it is because this is kind of hunting ground too and once you clear out the trees um the animals won't hang around much so your your hunting goes down turn this back on i need that that so yeah that's these some of these mods are just fantastic okay what do we do okay we're getting this built that's good All right, and how are we looking? All right, we're getting short on logs, but we got tons of firewood, so uh, we're about to go into major logging. Not captain logging, major logging. You're going to gather. Okay, you've planted, so now you can go to gather. And this guy's in gather mode. Okay, cool. All right, 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 right. All right, is game on yet? Nope. Oh, there's Dabo. Future coach of Alabama. Can't you use one to plant and one to harvest? You could, yes. But right now, everything's basically full. So we're going to go in harvesting mode and bring up this amount of logs um, we have. I built a couple of watchtowers. And then upgraded them, and these guys take a lot of logs. See, if I wanted to upgrade one of these, it would take 450, 450. Um, and the watchtowers, now if I go to watchtower 3, the radius will get bigger. But yeah, so since the hunters were slacking, I built two watchtowers to guard the, the donkey farm, which has nobody in it at the moment. So 
Really? I'm going to take you five guys out of here, your herdsmen, which means you're right here. So now you can go do something else. And now you guys are done. Uh, so go mine some ore. Sure. And the sand, I guess, you know what, let's try it. Miner Brandon died in an accident. Well, that's terrific. Riffin, Deliza, and Jean. Oh, sweet! Finally! <laughs> it's about damn time you guys showed up. Hang on. <laughs> All right, hang on. Uh, one, two, three. Okay. <laughs> the Raiders have shown up. Yay! <laughs> All right, let's pause, because I'm going to have to go into first... I mean, let's save. I'm going to have to go in first-person mode for this. Damn it! It took. It only took 25 years for the Raiders to find us. You dummies! Now, the question is, where are they? And the answer is going to be a little bit tricky. The ship has been spotted. Oh, they're in the corner of the map. Okay, here we go. See, see, them, see the birds all buzzing over them? I think that's why. I think that's part of the hint. Seeing. There it is. Gotcha. Alright, so here they come. So that means they're coming into this corner of the island over here. Now, why they're not showing up on the mini-map, I don't know. They may not actually be on the map yet. Oh, but they're getting close, quick. Okay, so, we need someone from the northern village. Let me see if we can find a kid up here. We saw an update. It hasn't been done since... Um... Yeah, no, they're, they're still... They're working on stuff. I think they've got like three or four different games that, you know, fall under the Life is Feudal um, name. You got your own, and then you got um, the MMO. So, uh, yeah, I'm not sure what their intentions are. Here's a hunter. Oh, you know what? We could probably just take a Ah, Kendrick, teenager. What are you doing? Carrying food, huh? Hmm, guess what, son? You're about to get to be a hero. Drop that food off. Very good. Now. All right, good job. Here we go. You are going to go which way? Oh, that's the wrong way. That's the direction we want to go. Dun -da -dun -da -dun -da -dun -da -dun -da. I hope you're well clothed. Oh, he doesn't have clothing indicated. All right, we're going to see how this works out. If we kill Kendrick, we kill Kendrick. All right, we need to do a test shot here, Kendrick. How's your aim, son? Looks pretty good. Okay, good. <laughs> Up the butt, Bob. Bop. <laughs> Bear. Toast. Kendrick's getting some shot practice in here. Boom. On the move. Fox even. Boom. Got him. All right. Dun 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 all right, where is it? Where are they? Where are the raiders? We get on this high spot right here so I can see. I need the weather to clear up though. Where's the ship? Because they land somewhere else, then we're going to have a little bit of an issue here. They should go pretty much straight to the closest land area. All right, so land hose. Shoot, what just happened? <laughs> oh, no! Damn it! Well, shoot, folks, we just crashed. 
So guess what? You're going to have to wait till the next episode to see how we deal with the Raiders. Because I'm not going to waste time reloading the game on you. That sucks. I'm sorry. But I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, give us a like. If you did, minor bug issue. I don't know if it's tied in with one of our mods. I don't think it is, though. We've had crashes just in the game before we even put mods in, in first-person view. So sometimes it happens. Uh, so we're going to see how we deal with the Raiders next time on Life is Feudal Force Village Deerfield. So make sure you uh, like, share, and subscribe, and turn on that notifications bell, ding -a ding so you know when we go live next. And uh, we appreciate your support. And if I don't see you prior, hope everyone has a great day, night, evening, morning, wherever you are on planet Earth or beyond, and a happy new year. And, oh, jeez, frickin', um, that might have been part of the issue there. So the game crashed. So... Uh, yeah, Happy New Year, everyone. And Roll Tide Roll. So we're going to watch some college, college football. So uh, take care. We'll uh, catch you next time. And I uh, appreciate you being here. I'm A-Train. It's over. And I'm out.